So you might be in a situation where for some reason the Sora application is giving you some problems. Now number one, if you're getting some sort of an issue or some sort of problem where it's telling you that you're basically, you know, let's say you need an invite code to even get into the application and it's telling you a bunch of invite error code issues, well you might want to go ahead and just double check the invite code that you're basically using. So right now Sora is completely invite only. So if you don't have a code, then you're going to need a code to order to enter. Now, I do have some codes I've used in my previous video, but if you happen to have an invite code, I'll leave it down in the description below so other people or in the comment section below so other people can view it. I'm pretty sure my codes are already going to be used by now. Now, make sure you're entering the code in properly. You can go on Reddit, the Sora AI subreddit. That's where I was able to find my code. Look in the mega thread. I'll actually link it down below. Go into that mega thread, sort by latest comments, and just look at there and just see whatever codes people are using. You know, just go and use those. Sometimes you might get lucky and there might be one. That's what happened with me. But number two, if you get an invite code, make sure you share it on there or in the comments of this video so other people can use it as well. Now, another important thing too is to update your Sora application. So right now I'm on the first generation of this software. I've already gone through, updated it, I think one time, but now I need to update it again. So if you already are past it, go ahead update your Sora application and you want to go ahead and make sure that that's not causing any issues either. Update the app and that right there is probably going to end up fixing the problem for a lot of users as well. Now if you do that and that's still not working, which you can try doing as well, is to try to go through and restart the Sora app. Sometimes you might just have to go through and reopen the application or restart the application and that could be another thing. So just close out of Sora try opening it back up and see if that ends up fixing it. If that still doesn't fix it, you might have to go through and just restart the application. So try holding the volume up button, the power button at the same time, slide the power off your phone, give it a couple seconds, power on your phone again, and you want to see if that ends up fixing the problem for you. So those are kind of the main ways to go and fix the problem for the most part. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.